Good morning, Eagles. Welcome to Friday's edition of Blue Eagle News, information for the students by the students. Today is October 28th. I'm Sophia Dellis. And I'm Dominic LaPlante. There's lots to get to today. Wear your spookiest themed PJs this coming Monday, October 31st. It's Halloween, so let's have some fun. No spooky PJs? Wear regular pajamas or Halloween colors. Raffle tickets will be handed out to teachers and students with prizes being given out at the end of the day. Pumpkin Smash is back! For just $2, bash open a pumpkin with a baseball bat for the chance to win prizes. But beware, some of the pumpkins are full of tricks and no treats. To reserve your spot, sign up with a class officer in room, or in room 115. The event will take place after school on Halloween near the tennis courts. Remember that today is the last day to purchase tickets. Connecticut Free College Application Day, as mentioned last week, now includes UConn, CCSU, SCSU, ECSU, and WCSU. You must submit your application on Tuesday, November 15th for your application fee to be waived. The field hockey team will be having a fundraiser dinner at Puerto Vallarta next Tuesday the 1st. Be there to support the team and eat some amazing food. The Black, Indigenous, and People of Color Community Fair is next Thursday at the Pickens Center. Be there from 5 to 7 for free food, music, presentations, and raffles. It will be a wonderful night for all involved. Now, Info 30. Reminder today is the last day to turn your AP payments to Mr. DeGuire. Today is also the last day to purchase a yearbook to get free stuff. The marketing period ends this Wednesday the 2nd. Make sure to talk with your teachers about any missed work. <laughs> Don't forget the Science Club meets on Mondays after school in room 533. And that's Info 30. <laughs> Good morning, this is Mr. Maltesi with some important news from the athletic department. As we approach the end of the regular season and begin postseason play, this is a good time to remind all of our spectators to exhibit good sportsmanship at our games. We should not be singling out players, using profanity or any inappropriate language, and should always be cheering positively. Failure to comply with these simple requests may jeopardize an individual's privilege of attending future Weathersfield High School contests. In addition, winter sports are just around the corner. A registration email will be sent from the athletic office on November 1st for those planning to participate in tryouts. All students must have a valid physical on file with the school, as well as be in good academic standing as outlined in the athletic handbook. Quarter one grades, which affect sports eligibility, close next week. Tryouts for girls basketball, wrestling, and hockey begin on Monday, November 28th, while all other winter sports start their tryouts on Thursday, December 1st. More information can be found on the Athletic Department website. Thanks, have a great weekend, and go Eagles! And lastly, tonight at 6 on Catone Field, our Lady Eagles undefeated soccer team is celebrating senior night before their game against Bristol Eastern. Let's fill the stands and show our Eagles some love tonight. Be there or be square. Seriously, let's support our Eagles. To stay informed with school news and announcements, follow us on Instagram at BlueEagleTV411. You can find us on Facebook and you can browse all of our videos on the Blue Eagles YouTube channel. Be sure to pay attention to the digital bulletins for things you should know about clubs, activities, and other important information. If you have an announcement or recognition that you would like to share with our WHS family, please email BlueEagleNews at BlueEagles at Weathersfield.me. Until next time, this is Sophia Dellis and Dominic LaPlante for Blue Eagle News. We are loud. We are proud. We are eagles. You're supposed to... I have a joke for you. You ready? Yeah, okay. <laughs> How do you know a skeleton is sick? How? It's coffin. Oh. Oh! <laughs>